Let us now learn a very important theorem related with area of parallelograms. Let us consider two parallel lines M1 and M2. AB is the line segment perpendicular to both of them. This AB is the constant distance between these parallel lines. Observe. These are the parallel lines. Now let me move the line segment AB. The distance between the parallel lines is everywhere same. ABCD is the rectangle made on the base BC between these two parallel lines. Let us construct a parallelogram EBCF on the same base BC and between the same parallel lines M1 and M2. Now let us explore the relation between the areas of the rectangle and the parallelogram. Look here, there are three figures of different colors. One green triangle, triangle ABE. One trapezium E, B, C, D and one red triangle, triangle D, C, F. This trapezium and the green triangle, triangle A, B, E make the rectangle A, B, C and D. The trapezium and the red triangle, triangle D, C, F make the parallelogram E, B, C, F. The trapezium is common in both rectangle as well as the parallelogram. Let us now find the areas of these two triangles. Both the triangles are between same parallels, hence their heights A, B and D, C are same. Let us now measure lengths of their bases AE and DF. Lengths of the bases of these triangles are same and since both the triangles are right angled triangles of same heights so they are congruent and their areas must be equal. Let me find out their areas. The area of the two triangles are same. Now area of the trapezium plus area of the triangle ABE will give you the area of the rectangle ABCD. And area of the trapezium plus area of the triangle DCF will give you the area of the parallelogram EBCF. Now what do you observe here? C. Area of the rectangle ABCD is same as area of the parallelogram EBCF. So we can say that area of the parallelogram EBCF is equal to area of the rectangle ABCD. Now let us explore. Change the shape of the parallelogram by dragging the vertex E. What do you observe? C. The areas of the triangles are changing. Area of the trapezium is changing. But every time area of the parallelogram is same as area of the rectangle ABCD. So area of the parallelogram is not changing at all. Now let me change the base by dragging the vertex C. See what happens? This time area of the rectangle is changing as well as area of the parallelogram is changing. Again look here. See both the areas, area of rectangle as well as parallelogram are changing. But every time the area of parallelogram is same as area of the rectangle. Now let me change the distance between the parallel lines. 
here also observe areas are changing but every time area of the rectangle is same as area of the parallelogram so we can conclude that any parallelogram drawn over the base bc will have the same area as the area of the rectangle made on the base bc and between the parallels m1 and m2 hence we can give the statement that parallelograms on same base or equal base and between same parallels are always equal in area Thank you.